lightweight scrap. Ferguson is four years his senior. He will have a five-inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC the lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A freestyle fighter holding a professional record of 26 wins, three losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Well, always great to be back in the MMA hotbed that is Rio de Janeiro as we get underway here at the Juness Arena in Brazil. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Nice punch there by Gage. They have started this fight off with a brawl. Excellent job of landing punches here. Slightly deflected. Gaethje gets hit with that hook shot there. He's got to be careful to not allow the offense to follow up here. Oh, snaps off the jab effectively yet again. Good defense there. Oh, effective strike there by Ferguson. Very nicely done. Oh, tagged him. Found a hole for that punch. Ferguson gets stung by that leg kick. And able to avoid the punch oh. there. Nice slip. He's in big, big, big trouble. Ferguson, I have to say, absorbing those strikes quite well. Oh, straight right. Oh, a huge block there. Oh, what a leg kick. He's being creative in there. And he lands a nice kick. Big oh, right hand there. Leg kick. Body kick, look at that. He, he landed a left hand there. Yeah, oh, we heard him. He on his feet. He's stumbling. Oh, he might be out. Big straight punch. The left hook hits home. He's keeping his head. Oh! He gets up, but he looks wobbly, Joe. Nice defense there. Huge block. Really a, a terminator quality, though, to Tony Ferguson. Eats these shots and just keeps moving forward. We approach the one-minute mark in the first round. So his opponent lands that kick to the body, Joe, and he has shown an increased susceptibility to that strike here tonight. Just misses with a left hook there. Pretty nice leg kick there, Joe. Good work on the feet by Gaethje. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing oh, that jab. Him again. He's hurt, he's hurt. over mercifully for his opponent. Multiple knockdowns there. Big, big round from Ferguson. A huge round, and his opponent should be commended for even making it out of that round because, boy, did he take some... Di Catch your breath. Breathe. Listen, you can do this now. He is ready to be out of there, okay? You can clearly rock and you're not... Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual. Someone's getting knocked out. Huge block there. Caught him with a punch. Misses with that punch. Ferguson's hook shot gets blocked. The defense saw that one coming. 
Oh, nice. Ferguson gets hit with a kick. That looked like it hurt you. Can we show you the total strikes? All right, so another stiff jab there. Really good use of that weapon, not unlike he did in the previous round. Switching stances here. Landed that one. Hand speed, man. Gaethje gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. El Kukui gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Nice kick there by Gaethje. Oh, double jab. Well, he's got a strong oh, oh, huge right hand. hand. This could be it right here. Try to establish that jab. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here. And as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some good shots. Oh, whoa. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt bad. Complexion of this one. Right back up to his feet. 90 seconds remain in the round. Nice leg kick. That bruise on his outer thigh is getting much worse. Well, Joe. Oh, he caught him on the button. He's got him hurt here. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Ferguson gets caught by the inside leg kick. over and the fighter's eye is something that we're going to keep an eye on no pun intended here it's starting to striking is unbelievable they're mixing it up perfectly loving the game with the kicks keep those going he's slowing down he can't good to have brazil's jenny on third round underway now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. That's a nice clean shot. Kick to the body. Changes his stance. You'll see oh! a lot of this from this fighter. Oh! This could be it! Very nice. We show you the total strike. Oh! He is going after it here. He's clearly hurt. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Punch is blocked. Gaethje gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Oh, big shot. Ferguson going for the body. Missed with that kick. He blocks the punch. Look at this. Nice one, two there. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is fighting them up now. So clock starting to become a factor here. Oh, and he's down. Back up. Oh, he's he hurt again. The there, Joe. He is in trouble. Blocks the shot.
How about that chin? Well, he eats a punch to the head there, Joe, and he would be wise to get his head off of that center line. It's almost as if he's moving straight into that punch. And he switches his stance yet again. Ooh, blocks the shot. Just out of the range with that right hand. Gaethje gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. That one hurt. Just misses with the jet. Right hand upstairs. 30 seconds now to go in the fight. 20 seconds to go in the fight. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Now he's inside control. The final horn sounds. All right, so somehow, some way, he survives to hear that final horn, but he in all likelihood is not gonna have his hand raised here tonight. There should be a clear winner in this one. He knocked his opponent down multiple times in the fight, and you gotta think that's enough to get him the nod from the judges in this one. We'll see how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score this contest 30-27, 29-28, 29-28, declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Tony Ferguson! Well, what else can you say about Tony Ferguson? Came in with the longest winning streak in lightweight history and only extends it.